So today we're going to be doing D1 flexion. We want to place the patient in D1 extension first. It's going to look like the toes are flexed, ankles slightly everted, ankles plantar flexed, the hips are extended, abducted, and internally rotated. When we go into D1 flexion, it's going to look like this, up and in. Up and in. Okay, now push into my hand, please. A little bit of resistance, up and in, and then going down and out. Up and in, a little bit of traction on the toes, and then down and out. The next move we're doing is D2 flexion. We want to start the patient in D2 extension. It's going to look like the hips are slightly adducted, extended, and externally rotated. The ankle is going to be plantar flexed, inverted, and toes flexed. The motion we're going to be doing looks like so up and out and then down and in. up and out down and in. now please push into my hand push 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 up and out very good now down and in up and out very good down and in now a little one more time up and out traction on the toes and then down and in that is D2 extension. Thank you.